And joining me now is the big winner from last night's primary, Republican Senate candidate Christine O'Donnell is back. Christine, congratulations on last night. Thanks for being on the program. Thank you. Thank you very much, Sean. And thank you to you and, and all of your, your viewers for helping make this happen and believing in me from the beginning. Let me ask you that. Have you heard from Mike Castle yet? No, I have not. Not yet. You have not. Now, we just got done saying I respect the, the will of the voter and their decision. Uh, there was a report out earlier today that he may not support you or endorse you. What do you think of the fact that he hasn't, wasn't gracious enough to call you and is saying something like that? Well, well, I can imagine that it would be hard. He, he hasn't lost an election in 40 years, and, and I think that he didn't see this coming. So he probably just needs some time to get through you know, it's the day after, but it's a shame that he won't endorse me because if the tables were turned, I would have endorsed him. And now he and I represent the Delaware Republican Party, and they chose last night who they want to represent them on the ballot. And if we continue in this divide, it's going to make it a lot harder to win in November. I still believe we can win. I have absolutely no doubt that we can win after hearing the great announcements of support that you just uh, shared with your viewers because, you know, this is such an important race, not only because of what our country is facing, but because the winner of this election can be sworn in the day after Election Day, because it's a special election for the seat once held by Joe Biden. Now, Senator Reid and Nancy Pelosi have already announced they're going to have a lame duck session with bills like cap and trade and the DREAM Act. And, you know, Harry <laughs> Reid called oh. my Democratic opponent his pet. So who do you want serving in that lame duck session? Someone who's going to promote that, that very liberal agenda that can't even get enough Democratic support or someone who is going to push back against the establishment and proven that you can have the determination and will to win.